Here with the weather uh, for December, it's not looking too bad for the weekend. Well, certainly very mild. I'm not sure we'll feel the benefit uh, that much because it is also going to be very windy. Uh, this afternoon, a lot of dry weather about. And here's another theme for the weekend, a lot of cloud. And there is a lot of cloud out there at the moment. But relatively settled, high pressure pushing up uh, from the south, dominating our weather. But it probably won't keep this weather system at bay, one that pushes southwards uh, through Sunday afternoon, bringing uh, some rain and drizzle to our part of the world. Now there is a lot of cloud out there uh, so far today. You can see it on the satellite picture here from earlier and that blanket of cloud I think will stick for the next few days. There might be some breaks out there here and there. Uh, they'll be fairly limited but if you see them you'll probably see them in the next few hours before it clouds in again uh, through this evening. Temperatures at around 8 or 9 degrees. A gentle to moderate breeze. That will pick up overnight. The cloud will come and go but I think overall quite a bit of cloud this coming night and as I mentioned the breeze picking up later in the night as temperatures drop back uh, to around six or seven degrees. A windy day to come tomorrow. I think particularly gusty with gusts uh, touching gale force just to the lee of high ground. It may well be it's a bit of a tricky day for high siders along the A1. A lot of cloud in the forecast, any brightness fairly limited once again, but it should be largely dry. Having said that, there could be a little bit of drizzle across the dales later in the day. And temperatures tomorrow on the mild side up at around 11 or 12 degrees. Uh, some uncertainty for Sunday, but at the moment it looks like a band of rain will sink southwards through uh, the afternoon uh, and then it stays mild into Monday. Thanks, Thanks very much. 14 there, not too bad. Exactly. Uh, that is it. And what a gorgeous sunset it was this evening. Red sky at night, Shepherd's Delight. Find out later in the programme if it does indeed mean we're going to have a nice weekend. We both have the builders in at the moment, and this mm. is not a week to have no windows, is it? Oh dear. Well, it's getting cooler. <laughs> Actually, this weekend's very mild, Amanda. You'll be oh, pleased. Yeah, Excellent. but it's windy, so uh, yeah, there might be a bit of a draft. Mm. <laughs> um, it's been a really nondescript weather day, hasn't it? Until the sunset this evening, and we've been getting some beautiful pictures in uh, via Weather Watchers with um, some lovely colours, some purples, some oranges, some reds, and they're a really good indication that we've got some settled uh, or at least dry weather to come over the next 24 hours. So the weather folklore. Uh, red sky at night, uh, shepherds or sailors delight certainly does uh, ring true. Keep your pictures coming in, they've been lovely, we were inundated with them this evening uh, to um, uh, the BBC Weather Watchers page but also on social media as well, Keely Donovan or Keely Dot Donovan. So yes, a lot of dry weather to come uh, through tomorrow, but it will be windy, uh, quite gusty winds. They could touch gale force in places. It is, though, going to be a largely dry day, disappointingly cloudy, I think. And the reason it's dry and settled is high pressure is pushing up from the south. I think early next week it, it will move away. Um, it'll recede again southwards, allowing uh, low pressure to move in, and it'll cool down next week as well. From around Tuesday onwards, we'll pick up more of a cool northwesterly flow. It has been dry uh, through today and this is a theme of our weather as we head through the next 48, possibly uh, longer than that. I think uh, the rain is expected later on Sunday. So uh, the cloud will come and go through this evening and overnight. The breeze will freshen and temperatures will fall back to around 6 or 7 degrees. Let's have a quick look at those high water times then. Uh, the next high water in Scarborough will be at around about quarter past 6 and then again at 25 past 6 in the evening. So a blustery day to come tomorrow, uh, a gusty westerly breeze, a particularly gusty just to the lee of high ground where the gusts could touch gale force. And I think it'll be one of those days where high siders on the A1 may struggle at times. Quite a lot of cloud, largely dry conditions, although there could be a little bit of drizzle across the dales later in the day and relatively mild for the time of year with temperatures up at around 11 or 12 degrees. Looking further ahead into Sunday, a lot of dry weather, I think, particularly uh, for daylight hours uh, through Sunday. So Sunday morning, it does look largely dry. There has been some uncertainty. Some of the weather uh, models are bringing rain down through the afternoon. The latest model has it uh, dry until after dark for our part of the world. So uh, rain by Sunday evening. Uh, very mild conditions on Monday with some outbreaks of rain in the west. And then as we move through next week, uh, high pressure will move away to the south, allowing low pressure to move in. And you'll notice it does cool down uh, through next week particularly uh, towards the end of the week Amanda lovely double figures and the Strictly final that's me sorted this weekend <laughs> double whammy yes are you watching <laughs> I will be very yes. excited excellent <laughs> watch this space for the winner 
Hello there, good evening. A lot of dry but cloudy weather continuing over the next day or so. Tomorrow it is going to be rather blustery though, uh, but for most of us away from the Dales, it will be dry. At the most of Sunday too, but later in the day, this weather system will spread southwards. It may well be uh, that most of us stay dry though for daylight hours. So out there at the moment, the breeze will pick up, it'll be largely cloudy overnight and temperatures will fall away to around six or seven degrees. So tomorrow morning, it will be rather blustery. In fact, it's going to be a windy day. Uh, the gustiest of the conditions just to the east of high ground where they could touch gale force. I think it'll be a tricky day for high siders on the A1. A lot of cloud through tomorrow, but largely dry away from uh, the dales where it could be a little bit damp later on in the day. Um, mild, temperatures above average, but factor in the breeze. And I don't think you'll really feel the benefit, 11 or 12 degrees. A lot of cloud, but a largely dry day to come on Sunday. Rain spreading from the north later in the day. And then low pressure moves in again as we head through next week it also cools down.